Hi, so here's part two of our top bar navigation tutorial. At the end of the last um, tutorial, we had set up our graphics using Sketch and imported them into Xcode. We set up our um, top navigation view. We're using auto layout, so we set its initial position. And we also added a drop shadow. So we have this bar here that navig um, animates onto the screen when the view loads or when the view actually appears on the screen. So what I want to add next is the ability to swipe and um, um, swipe upwards and the view will disappear and swipe downwards and we bring this view back on. So here's how we do that. First of all, we need to add a gesture recognizer. So from our objects here, we'll get a, a swipe gesture. We drag that and we're going to attach it to our super view there. Then we need to connect that across as an action. So we'll call this one swipe down, the swipe down action, there we go, okay, so we connect that, come across then to our implementation file, and we also need to edit the properties of this, we want swipe direction to be down, there we go, so when we swipe down, what we want to do is animate this view onto the screen, so what we're going to do is create an actual method because instead of having to copy this code over and over again, we'll create animate bar on method here. So we'll just take this code that we have in the view did appear and we'll put it into our animate bar on method here. And now our view did appear, we'll have our self animate bar on. So we're going to call that method when the view appears, which will animate the bar onto the screen. Same here, when we swipe down, self animate bar on, and that will have the same effect. So basically, when the view did appear, we're going to call this animate bar on method, which will animate the bar onto the screen. The same when we swipe down. Now to animate the bar off the screen, we need to have a swipe up. So again, we'll add another swipe effect to our view. In the properties, we'll change it to swipe up. Come across to our header file, drag this across an action, so swipe up as an action, connect. Now I'll create another action here, um, sorry, method, which we'll call animate bar off. So we'll take this same block of code, sorry, spelling mistake there, animate bar off. Take the same block of code, but this time we're going to animate it off the screen, so we need to set its vertical coordinate to minus 45. And when we swipe up, we want to call that method animate bar off. And there we go. So now, when we run this in our simulator, you see there the bar animates onto the screen and if we swipe up it goes off, we swipe down and it comes on. So you can see there we've implemented this animation. So it's quite simple and straightforward as you can see. We're using um, the animate um, blocks. We just created them in their own methods there. And we just call those methods whenever this gesture is recognized. And that's it. That's really all there is to um, creating a um, top navigation bar that can be animated on and off the screen and can also be called by, by swiping. This bar could obviously contain um, text, buttons, navigation buttons, whatever it is that you, that you like. 